Hi, how you guys doing? Thank you for coming back to the channel. I'm just gonna show you real fast what I saw today and in, a, in the past few days, you know? And uh, thank you for coming back. Good to see you today. It's Tuesday. Hope you're having a great day. Please subscribe to the channel, put a thumbs up, and uh, I will really appreciate it, okay? Let me show you. We saw this one, the Diamondbacks, Arizona Diamondbacks, um, from this uh, team is three pieces, okay? Where's the other one? Ah, there you go. It's genuine from the MLB, you know, three piece set. It's for a baby. And yeah, newborn, yeah, newborn, zero to three months. Original price, retail price is $22.99. It has a MLB tag. And it's nice, it's cute, you know, it's for, for babies. Anyways, we sold this one on Poshmark. I put it for $12. A customer sent me an offer for $10. I'm, I'm sorry, for $9. And I said, come on, that's too low. I sent a, a counter offer for $10, and they accepted it. So, made a little money. This one came from Barstow. So, everything's paid off already. This is pure profit. So, obviously, the $10 minus fees is going to be like six or five, I think, because Poshmark charges you 20%. But it's okay. We're moving something. The next thing, this is beautiful. <clears throat> Look. And I bought this one only because HDH Dave. You can look at his channel. They have a podcast with him, Commonwealth Picker, Kevin, and Kerry, uh, American Arbitrage. And they have a channel called Trash to Cash. And it's funny. They're funny, man. I mean, I, I watch them. But I watch HDH Dave by himself, you know, besides the podcast. And he always buys stuff like this. I would never buy anything like this, never. Because this is a toy, I'm like, ah, a toy, okay. But it had value, and I saw it at the Swami the other day, I went to um, Van Buren in Riverside, California, and I'm like, wait a minute, this might have good value, it's Disneyland, it's a popcorn, um, to put popcorn, you can open this thing, see and it's clean and it lights up it lights up it's a 50th anniversary thing and yeah anyway so i i said i'm gonna look at it i think i bought it for two or three dollars i'm not i don't remember it. i think it was two dollars anyways and it sold for 20 ay, let me double check i think it sold for 24.99 or 29.99 Anyways, after fees, it's going to be like 20-something for me. So, it's not bad. Keep an eye and take a look at something interesting always. Oh, especially Disney. You know, something that's collectible, something that's a limited edition run. Keep an eye for it because it's good. The other thing, I went with my family. You guys, I, I filmed also. Over there. This is a Universal Studios past member only tour. Uh, this is from the 60th anniversary. And I got it for free because I bought the other ones. You remember I put it on the channel too. I bought the trams, this, the cards, you know. I bought three of them. So they gave me three and I told the lady, can I have one more for my mom? So she gives me two more. So this is free. It's a, a, a fridge magnet. magnet. So not bad, huh? Thirteen ninety, I sold it on eBay. This was Posh. Posh and Posh. This is eBay. Thirteen ninety free shipping which is not bad i mean i don't care five dollars cheaper yeah it doesn't matter how much it costs uh, this is only like one ounce but from one ounce to four ounces it's gonna be the same five four something almost five bucks so minus the fees minus the shipping i'm still making like seven dollars and i got five of them five times seven thirty five dollars for free so i'm not complaining <laughs> it pays for the gas at least so it's cool. Now, the rest of the side that I sold is, oh, this one. This one I got for free, actually, at a state sale that I bought. You know, I buy a lot of things. So, the lady said, here, take it. It was a, a, a bunch of them, like maybe 20. And I sold a lot of five. The first lot, I still have like 10, 15 more. This is from the Korean War. 50th anniversary, five patches, a lot of five, see? And I sold it for $9.90, free shipping. 
which is okay like i said after fees and everything <clears throat> everything's um free well not free but yeah free because it was free everything i meant was liquid you know this pure profit because it was free now this one was not free but i had it for almost two years and it finally sold and i lowered the price this is a champion sports raceback double dry bag tank top size extra large new with tax my cost on this i bought a, a pallet of um, clothing from jc penny my cost on this one is 250. i sold it for 1075 free shipping so minus the fees minus the 250 and everything and the shipping so the profit will be like maybe three bucks to something three bucks and it's okay because i have to be i, I want to move everything fast i don't want to keep something more than six months no forget six months one two three months no more six months seven months a year is too much this one i found it you guys saw it i made a short and i made a video i found it on the stuff that i bought from these girls marta and ingrid and uh, i bought uh, the bucket of legos and it was there and i still have two or three more that i found three more ds games so it's good good profit and i still have the legos eh? so <laughs> Okay, this one's a Pokemon uh, Ranger Guardian Science Nintendo DS. The cartridge only, no book, no uh, box or anything. Okay. And then uh, I sold this one for $29.90 plus shipping. Hmm? Not bad, huh? The other thing is. Ah, I sold two of these. Uh, they're the Apple AirTag Leather Loop Red Seal. I put read comments. Why? because like i always tell you you have to disclose everything this was brand new in box but the box was a little damaged little the the inside was good i mean the item was good but the box see, was a little damaged and i disclosed and took pictures of everything because i don't want any problems and they were happy this got to the this got to the customer and they were like as described they gave me five stars which was good now, the last thing I want to show you is this. Are you... Come on, okay. You remember this terrible day? Terrible day in history of our country. It was bad. Like people say, you will never, never forget where you were at the time you listened to this bad, terrible news. This was a vintage Orange County Register newspaper, Wednesday, September 12th, 2011, 2001. I sold this one for $10.95 plus media mail shipping. And it shows everything, you know, it shows, um, obviously, let me show you. Oops, can open it up. And it shows you all the terrible things and you will never forget these things, you know. So, anyways, this this customer bought this one, you know, for his collection, and um, yeah. So, 1095, and that's it. All these past couple of days, not a lot, but thank God, you know, a couple of things went out. Hope you guys are having a great day. Okay, enjoy, and let's see. I'm gonna make a couple of videos later on this week okay hope to see you soon